Well, with much fanfare, here he is, the axe murderer, the Brazilian brawler, Vanderlei Silva, back for more here tonight. And this guy is really responsible for putting on some of the biggest and best shows in the history of mixed martial arts. His patented walk there in Japan over the years. This man is a force to be reckoned with, still at this stage of his career, as Vanderlei Silva makes his much-anticipated return here tonight. Vanderlei Silva is the former pride middleweight champion and one of the greatest fighters to ever come out of Brazil. His aggression is second to none, and his highlight reel is a true thing of violent beauty. Is it great to see this guy make the walk here tonight? Really as accomplished a striker as we've seen come into the UFC in years. And no surprise, he'll be interested in keeping the fight standing tonight. We'll see if he can put on a striking clinic. If the takedown defense holds up, figures to have a pronounced advantage on the feet. This guy has one punch knockout power. And when a fighter has that kind of ability, it's always a big advantage. for this light heavyweight tilt. Two years apart, these two fighters, and they both possess a similar height and reach. All right, now for the official introductions. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a Muay Thai fighter, holding professional record of 33 wins, 10 losses, one draw, and one no contest. He stands five feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, the X Murderer And now he's going fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, 10 losses. He's down six feet one is tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Irvine, California. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight champion, Quinton Rampage Jackson. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Steve. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? You ready? Dateline Las Vegas, Nevada. We are underway here at the MGM Grand Garden. Rampage Jackson is known for his huge slams. He's a solid wrestler, a powerful striker, and he doesn't. Whoa! Hurt him with that overhand. Jab falls up with a nice right hand. Oh, wow. He's definitely hurt. Oh, he's out. He's out. He's out. Unbelievable. Beautiful knockout here early in the first. Well, Joe, we've talked a lot about his technique and how technical a striker he is. And that was really the shot heard around the world to get the finish here in the first round. Again, maybe he caught the guy cold a little bit. He didn't have a chance to warm up. But that is a huge result for him here tonight. And on the other side, he didn't take much damage. So big, big win for him here tonight. And here we see it one more time. Look at the timing in this shot. Boom! And then he's out. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest. At one minute, three seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Quinton Rampage Jackson! 
So just the way he drew it up here tonight, what a monumental moment and knockout to get his hand raised here tonight. He kept the judges out of it. He has certainly set himself up for a major opportunity here moving forward. But you can be sure tonight is about this knockout. He'll be celebrating deep into the night with his friends, his